Hey guys, I am very excited to share this video with you. So, something that I really enjoy is creating in the kitchen and coming up with healthy, yummy treats and recipes to try. And these recipes are kind of like dessert style treats, like healthy versions of desserts. So I've always had a very healthy lifestyle and eaten quite healthily and the last like five years from about year 10 was when I started to first get into like a healthy lifestyle and learning more about nutrition and eating healthily and that's when I stopped eating junk food so I don't want to promote any type of restrictive mindset and I have obviously talked about recovering from an eating disorder and being in a bad place with that so definitely live a balanced lifestyle. Like if you'd want treats every now and then, go for it. It's not going to kill you. You gotta have a good relationship with food. But personally, the things that I was restrictive about were still healthy foods. I just never really was that interested in, you know, junk food. I don't like saying that, but it's just, you know, the easiest way to explain it, easier than saying. Highly processed, refined, artificial, etc., etc. However, one of the biggest tips I have for people who struggle with, with eating healthy foods all the time is eat delicious healthy foods. Eating healthily doesn't mean it doesn't taste good. Honestly, I personally think it tastes so much better. And one of the reasons I don't eat junk foods is because, well, I don't crave it or want those things, but, but I do prefer healthier foods like for example these recipes i'm going to show you are so delicious they taste better than junk foods and that may be because i haven't had junk food in so many years that that my taste buds have adapted to healthy foods and they taste amazing to me but they honestly taste so good and yeah so i really wanted to share these recipes with you guys so these recipes are all kind of like sweet dessert style treats they're all healthy whole foods they're all vegan so they're dairy free they're gluten free not that that is what makes them healthy because obviously you can have non-vegan things that are healthy and if you're not gluten intolerant like if you don't have celiac disease and gluten is not the enemy i know so many people are like against i think gluten is like terrible for you but gluten is just a protein found in wheat and of course there are healthy complex carbohydrates that have gluten if you don't have celiac disease then don't be afraid of gluten but to make these as inclusive as i could i wanted them to be vegan and gluten free so anyone can have them and well unless you're allergic to nuts sorry um that would really suck but these recipes are gluten free dairy free etc hashtag we get it but they are delicious and full of great whole foods and foods from the earth basically. So I hope you enjoy these recipes. Please let me know if you try them out. So some of these recipes I've been making for a long time, like my bliss balls. I've been making them since year 11 or year 12. And oh my gosh, everyone that I've you know given these to, like my friends and family have loved them. People have messaged me before that have tried the recipe out saying, they were amazing so don't burst my bubble if you don't like them but i think you will because they're amazing the other recipes i haven't made as much like actually the banana bread was kind of i was trying it out and like tweaking it as i went for the first time but that turned out so amazing oh my gosh the banana bread is something else sorry to use this word but the texture was so moist and really good however it was really crumbly so yeah, just be careful with it all falling apart, but you know, it tastes amazing. And the other thing I wanted to add was the sweet potato brownies are very, very dark and rich. If you like your dark chocolate, like you love it really dark and rich, you know, you'll probably like it. But like, if you're like, you need a bit of sweetness in your life, they're going to be quite bitter for you. So you might want to like double the quantity of everything besides the cacao. But I love my dark and richness, so... I thought they were good. Otherwise, these recipes are all super delicious. Literally, you'll never need to have junk food again because these taste better. But anyway, let's just shut up and get to these delicious recipes. of your nights just sitting on your own I should have done so much more like 
given you the things you asked for And I know I was wrong It's what I try to tell you with a song Tell you with a song What if I said I'm sorry? What if I'd make a scene? Wouldn't that make you mine again? You all I'll ever need Didn't I make you laugh? Didn't I make you smile? Didn't I make you feel like you were happy for a while? I know that I've done so many things that let you down But I hope that you give me one more chance to make you mine When I close, close my eyes I know that you're the only thing I see And it makes, makes me cry To think that you are no longer with me What if I said I'm sorry? Thank you. 
guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoy the video. I hope you enjoy these recipes. Please let me know if you try them out and your thoughts and how you tweaked them because you can just tweak them in whatever ways you like. It would mean a lot if you could give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I upload every Wednesday and Sunday. Lol, I feel like such a like YouTuber doing these and things where I ask you to subscribe to me, but please still do it. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.